Joe of Trades here. We are going to learn how to draw a house and a barn. These are for my young artists who were just trying to get basics down. So we're just going to do shapes today. So the house starts with a square. So let's draw a nice big square for our house. Okay. And on top of the square, I like to draw a triangle like this. And then we're going to add the roof part. Now don't be discouraged. We're just going to follow the line. We're going to make one parallel line here, give it some room, and then one parallel line here, parallel line. <laughs> And then we'll just connect it like that. Okay, and what I like to do is put the door, and it's just a tall rectangle right here. And then we're gonna have two squares on the side for windows. So let's do the squares. And then since there's a whole bunch of empty space up here, I like to put another kind of window. So we'll just draw a circle. So see how we have all these fun shapes in here. We have squares, we have circle, we have a triangle, a rectangle. Okay, and then up here, I like to put some lines across. So we'll do a line here, here, and here. And I like to put some crisscross lines in here. So. It looks like a window. And then you can do the windows two ways. You can either do a cross or a plus sign in here or a T, or you can do curtains. Now it looks like an R on one side, like that. And then you're gonna do a backwards R on the other side. See? So it looks like curtains now if you color it in. So you can do windows two different ways. Okay, and then don't forget your um, door handle so you can actually get in your house. Okay, so that's one way to draw a house. And then if you remember the other ways we, or other things that we drew this week, we did bushes, remember? You can draw some bushes in here. We can draw a tree. Okay, we can do some different kinds of bushes, like right here. I like these little circle ones. And then we can put our flowers in there. So we, there's some basics that you put together. Now, I wanted to teach you guys how to draw a barn because kids love to draw farm animals, right? So we gotta learn how to draw a barn too for them to go to. So the barn's gonna be right here. We're gonna also start with a basic square. Okay. Then we're gonna draw another square inside this square, but on the bottom, like a big, it's gonna be a big barn door. Okay, now across here, we're gonna draw some lines like that. And then we're not gonna go all the way across. See how I don't go into that square? And we'll draw three on this side too. Now on here, on the barn door, you can either color it and so it's open, or we can make an X across it. Okay, so it looks like it's closed. All right, so on the top part, we're gonna draw a kind of an, um, hmm, I don't know how to tell you what it is, so we're just gonna draw it so you can see what it looks like. We're gonna draw one line here, and then we're gonna curve down like this. 
and then we'll do the opposite. And then we will do the parallel lines just like this roof right here. And we're going to follow down right here. And then we're going to follow down on this side. And we'll draw all these same little lines across. And then a rectangle up here. And then color this rectangle in because we want to let some air into the barn so it can cool off, right? And there is your barn. So with your barn, you can do the same thing. You can draw your trees, you can draw your grass, you can draw, you can draw a fence if you want. You can do a ton of fun things with this. We'll do this simple tree. Um, if you wanted to draw a fence, they're, e they're pretty easy. You just draw your lines and then you draw a line down like that. There's your fence. So I hope that was fun and easy for you. And I will see you tomorrow.